Alright, so welcome back to another 2018 free agency rebuild, and in today's video we're going to be doing the DeAndre Jordan Mavericks rebuild. I'm sorry that I couldn't get a video out to you yesterday. It was the 4th of July, so if you do celebrate that, you should probably understand that I don't really think many people got videos out yesterday. It was kind of a busy day, I was kind of out all day, so might be on that, but today I'm going to be doing the DeAndre Jordan Mavericks rebuild. Very excited for this. I really like the signing by them. I know they said... They were originally looking at three centers. Him, Clint Capella, and DeMarcus Cousins. We know how one of those worked out. Biggest snake of all time. But yeah, DeAndre Jordan signed a one-year deal. Pretty much just accepted his team option. Well, not he really didn't accept the team option because he traded to them. But it was the same amount of money, I think, for them to sign him. So I like this signing. They really need a good center. They haven't had a good center in a while. Well, that's not in a while. But I know Dirk used to play center when they had like Tyson Chandler and stuff. But good center here. Good rim protector. Good rebound is what they need. Still got Barnes in this team, who I don't know if is going to be here this whole video. Dennis Smith Jr. will. Obviously, Doncic will. Dirk's probably going to retire after this season, Wesley Matthews. So, yeah, pretty much nobody on this team. I forgot we had Kostas, too. He's going to be in the G League, actually. And can I send Brunch in the G League as well? I can. So, hopefully, those two guys are going to be good for us next year. But Jordan will be here the whole video because it's his video. Not sure about Barnes. Most likely Smith and, obviously, Doncic. So, pretty much three untouchables at the moment. So, let's look at this. I'm not going to be making any trades year one, I don't think. Just really doesn't seem necessary. Um, but what I want to do is get up 35, 35, and we'll go 33 here. So this is going to be the rotation first season. If we make the playoffs, great. If we don't, it's fine. We should have our first round pick this year, and we do. So it's not the end of the world if we don't. Hopefully we will, and I'll see you guys at the end of season number one. All right, guys, so end of season number one, Russell Westbrook averages a triple-double and wins MVP. We go 28-54, and 54, so... Me thinking this team can make the playoffs maybe wasn't the smartest thing in the world. I think we really just need a better power forward and a better small forward. So I think if we get one of those two things in the offseason, playoffs next year. Doncic does win Rookie of the Year, though. So that is a positive. 18.5 points, 5.5 rebounds, 7.5 assists. Just an absolute monster. Gordon, six man, Gilbert, Don, and Steve Kerr does win Coach of the Year. So we are going to have a good draft pick, which is always a positive. Definitely going to help us. Actually, I'll show you guys the stats. I didn't even show you guys the stats. Stats, Doncic let us in score, and then it was Barnes, Smith Jr. Dirk actually wasn't too bad. DeAndre Jordan is what you get from DeAndre Jordan. 11 points, 14 rebounds pretty much. So, yeah, I'll take that. So, definitely looking forward to next year. Not a great year at all, but I'm still in shock about DeMarcus Cousins. Like, that is absolutely crazy. Like, that is something that you used to be able to do in, like, 2K with, like, LeBron. When, like, you had, like, such a good team, and you wanted to offer somebody the middle level exception, and they would just take it. Like, that's something that used to happen. Doesn't happen anymore, but it used to happen, but... Just absolutely unreal. Uh, Rick Carlisle, one of the best head coaches in the NBA, in my opinion, not going anywhere. This guy's good. Daryl Armstrong's horrible, so... Hmm, hmm, will it will take... Did Dirk retire? Damn, I guess... Oh, Dirk did retire. Okay. Dirk Nowitzki to be our assistant coach, and then our head scout, we will take Rod Baker. And then where's the boy, Jimmy Lynch? There we go. So, we have these three. We get two of them after day one. We should get Dirk. Come on. There we go. So Dirk's going to be our new assistant coach. Let's head up to the draft, see what pick we ended up getting. Hopefully it's a pretty good pick. So that would kind of suck if, okay, we got four. Looks like we may have dropped one spot, but still that's not too bad. So I think I'm just going to take somebody fourth overall, honestly. I'm going to move these two second round picks for, oh boy, I wanted a future. Can I just not have Miles Plumley? Sure, sure, whatever. I really don't care. So we had the fourth overall pick. What do I want to take? Do I want to take Zion? Is, would Zion be here still? No, he probably won't. He's like the number two. Damn it. Um, if I can't get him, and I, I don't really want Bull Bull. All right, I can, I would probably take Reddish and have him play small forward. So, yeah, we'll definitely get somebody good, and I'll see you guys at rookie signings. So, we're here in the draft, and I did want Zion Williamson. So, we're just going to make this trade. The third overall pick, a top three protected first round pick next year. Two seconds for Zion and Willie Colley Stein. Oh, my God, trading's broken. Oh, my Christ alive. If this doesn't work now, oh, this is going to be mad annoying. Come on, please just work. Don't don't glitch out on me. Okay, thank you. If I can't get him now, I'm going to be kind of mad. Okay, we still can. First round pick, top 10 protected in a second. Welcome to the team, Zion Williamson. So I really like that pickup because he can play both small forward or power forward, really whatever I need him to. And of course, I can also switch Doncic to small forward if I go out and get a shooting guard this year. So we're good. I just kind of wanted somebody with versatility, and that's what we got. I know I could have gotten maybe Reddish, but I feel like I got Reddish in like a couple videos ago, and I haven't gotten... Zion in a little while. So welcome to the team, Zion. We also got Lou Davis. I don't... Okay. Sure. Uh, so Barnes declines. Okay. Powell accepts. Brunson's a 77. I'm going to bring him back. Kostas is a 74. 
So not too bad. I will, I will take that. That I, That is doable. So qualifying, no thanks. We do have... Did Wesley Matthews have an extra year? Let me just see. No. So it's pretty much only Dwight Powell with a bad contract. So we should have some pretty good money. Oh my god, trading's broken. So we should have some pretty good money for free agency. And so if we can get like a superstar shooting guard or something, I think that would be great. Robert Williams. Yes, please. Definitely. I'll, I'll absolutely take that. So moratorium. Let's look at free agency at the moment. So we obviously need to re-sign DeAndre Jordan, wherever he is. He's down here. He has no offers yet. He does have a big cap hold, though. So I'm going to put an offer for, like, Kyrie, because why wouldn't I put an offer for Kyrie? I'm also going to throw an offer at, hmm, we will do, god damn, it's not a great free agency. Uh, well, it is, but it's just like, we'll throw an offer at Clay, I guess. And then I'm probably going to trade Clay if I get him, just because I kind of get Clay Thompson a lot. And then we'll also throw an offer at Boogie Cousins, because why not? The biggest bitch in the NBA. Uh, and we'll give him a no trade clause, because I wouldn't be trading him. So let me just make sure DeAndre Jordan has no offers, which is good. And we got Clay Thompson. So I'm going to announce the rights pretty much on all these guys. And we should be able to pick up. I forgot, honestly, shit, I forgot about Harrison Barnes. All right, well, we really don't need Harrison Barnes anymore, so I'm kind of just, I'm just going to let him go. I, I, I'm fine with it. We, we do need DeAndre Jordan back, though, so that's kind of the important one. So Cousins went back to the Warriors. Of course he did. So Jordan still doesn't have any offers. We have Clay, who will be traded. Most likely, and DeAndre Jordan still doesn't have any offers, so we're good there. Jordan, just take this, please, and we pick up DeAndre Jordan. So he's back. <clears throat> is, what is, okay, I thought for a second that Harrison Barnes might still be there, but he is not. So now we're going to trade Clay Thompson either for another shooting guard or for a small forward, like Gordon Hayward, maybe I would take. Oladipo and a first round, this, whoa, this is actually a pretty good trade. Okay, that pick has, a, our pick next year has a ton of value. All right, I think I'm going to do this trade. Victor Oladipo and Miles Turner, and this pick is obviously not going to be worth much next year. So, yeah, let's do this trade. It's not really an overpay because that pick next year is not going to have any value. That's basically, if you can understand that. So, I think I'm going to be playing Miles Turner at power forward just because he does go up and overall, and he's probably the better shooter out of the two. So, Doncic small, or is going to play shooting guard. Zion's going to go to power forward. So, let's see. Smith and Brunson. Brunson's going to play. He's a 77. Oladipo. Oh, shit. All right, we're just going to move Doncic actually to small forward. And Doncic, Zion can be a backup. Okay. Old Depot, we need a backup. So we have Doncic and Williamson here. Kostas can maybe get some minutes. Turner and Williams and DeAndre Jones. So we need a backup small forward. Or not small forward. Jesus. Backup center and backup shooting guard. I like totally forgot we even just got Old Depot on that. So shooting guards. We still have some decent money. Um, Bohong Bogdanovich. Oh, well, we only have seven mil. All right. Uh, I thought we had a little bit more. Justin Holiday, not horrible. I'll, I'll take Justin Holiday. It's not horrible. And then we need a backup center. Uh, can I just go? We don't have enough for Holmes, probably. Mitchell Robinson, damn. Wants that much money already. Tyson Chandler, if he wasn't 36, I would bring him back. Uh, I'll take Alex Len. Not the worst option in the world. And we get neither after day one, and we get both after day two. So welcome to the team, both of you. Team is all set. We have good players, and I'll see you guys at the start of season number two with the rotation. So this is going to be the rotation for season number two. It's going to be Dennis Smith Jr., Victor Oladipo, Luka Doncic, Miles Turner, and DeAndre Jordan. Off the bench, Zion Williamson, Robert Williams, Justin Holiday, Alex Len, and Jalen Brunson. So not a horrible rotation. Definitely think this team can be in the playoffs possibly even compete for a championship, and I will see you guys at the end of season number two. So end of season number two here, Russell Westbrook, once again, triple-double MVP, 59-23 and 23 on the year, not too bad. I believe that actually might have been first in the West, was it? Yeah, it was first in the Western Conference. Okay, normally 59 wins gets you like third or fourth, but I will absolutely take it. Player stats, Dennis Smith Jr. lesson scoring, then it was Doncic, Oladipo, Turner, Williamson, DeAndre Jordan, rebounds was Jordan, and assists was Smith. So first round. We're taking on the Portland Trailblazers. Honestly, I think we can sweep them. I really do. And we do. Oh, we almost got to face the Pelicans. That would have been so much nicer because this team is a freaking god squad. Uh, I mean, we did take clay from them. Going to a game seven. Not what you want to hear, and we're kind of we're kind of getting blown out. All right, a little bit of a comeback. And we're going to win. We just beat the Warriors with the Marks Cousins. I don't care if we lost Clay Thompson. That's kind of crazy, but okay. We should be able to murder the Thunder now. Come on, 2K, and 
NBA Finals to take on the 76ers. Let's check out their team. Who do they have? Simmons, MB. Yeah, it's pretty much the same team. They really didn't add anybody, but yeah, they're obviously still very, very good. Ben Simmons is going to be an issue, but we are tied at two games apiece, up 3-2, and can we win at home? Please, 2K. 2K, let me do it. <clears throat> I don't know why I always get like interrupted when I speak in these games. All right. We're down by one. No promises of anything, but I'll see you guys in the game. Here we go. We're down by one. Looking to win a championship. Let me... What is this lineup? Oh, my Christ alive. Why is Dennis Smith Jr. not in? Okay, that's the lineup I wanted. I don't care how tired you are. It is, <clears throat> it is not the time to be tired. Okay, well, at least we have the ball. <clears throat> Jesus, I'm sorry. I cannot speak. Old Depot. Um, they don't have Ben Simmons in for some reason. Can I just get a pick? DeAndre Jordan. What the fuck, actually? Can I just have a normal pick just for once? Just do something. Oh my god, he missed. Okay, I have no idea how he missed, but this is still so bad. Um, yeah, just go down here. Turner. That's not what I meant to do. Jesus, kick it out. This is... Jesus, it feels slow right now. It really does. Give me a pick. DeAndre Jordan up to the basket. Doncic, thank you. Okay. There we go. Putting us up by one. I finally get some points. I know how bad I am. Here we go. And I just really want Dennis Smith Jr. in because I can, like, blow by people with him. He's kind of like... He's kind of like... When you play with Kyrie... Like, I'm not saying he's got Kyrie's, like, handles or his, like, ability. Go steal. Push it up. Zion, you got to run the break. You got to run it. Up for the dunk. Okay. That was big. That was very, very big. Puts us up by three points. Two minutes left to go. Not sure how, how this will go, but still, we're good. Fultz, just play some good defense. I was going, right here, let's use her. Zion's got 12 points. Come on. Over, over. Come on. Do something. Nope. God damn it. Oh, my God, he missed. Oh, he missed. Give it up to Doncic. Okay, slow it down. Slow it down. And pick. Dude, DeAndre Jordan's horrible at giving picks. Oh, quick layup from Doncic. Doncic is a monster. Just getting everything to go. I'm, I'm just going to keep using him. I mean, if it ain't broke, don't fix it, right? He's gotten, like, besides the, the Zion steal, he's got all the points. Come on. Come on. TLC will not end. No, what the hell? Nice defense. Nice defense. Old Depot has five points. That's awesome. Really coming up clutch when it counts the most. Really making me look good for trading Clay Thompson for you. And pick from Turner. No. Jesus Christ alive. That's a contact layup and one. I don't know how this is happening, but I just chirp Victor Oladipo and then he comes up clutch. So whatever works. Free throw is, are you, bruh, that would have probably sealed it, but it's pretty much still over. Dennis, no, what the fuck? Actually, how could something just turn around and just go from so good to so bad so quickly? Especially when it's not even my fault. Like, I know things normally are my fault. That actually was not. Turner, roll. Go up, DJ. And one. Let's go. Let's go. I don't know how, but it works. DeAndre Jordan, if you could ever hit a free throw, that would be clutch. Now is the time to do it. Let's go. It's a 58% free throw. We're up by five. Most likely going to win this game, and I'll see you guys with the Finals MVP. So Finals MVP does go to Dennis Smith Jr. He averages 28 points pretty much, 5 rebounds, and almost 10 assists. So very well deserved from him. So we got the championship done. That is good. The team is pretty much all set. I mean, I really don't think anything's going to change our staff. I do want to bring back Rick Carlisle. And CFO will just go Eugene Sung. Okay, we get both of them. Works for me. So time for the draft. I don't think we're going to have any picks. Um, Do we have... Okay, we actually have two seconds. I'm just going to, yeah. That's fine. Don't really think I'm going to make any trades. I just don't want two roster spots, so it's fine. Don't really want to waste any draft picks either. So, set up the team player options right now. I think it's just going to be Doncic and, like, Smith Jr. And Lou Davis and Robert Williams. So, yeah. The team is pretty much all set. I really think, is Jalen Brunson a free agent? Because that would suck if he is. Um, is Jalen Brunson a free He is. God damn it. He wants 19 mil, but we can afford him. So, yeah, welcome to Team Jalen Brunson. Unfortunately, Ray, Ray Spalding and Kostas are going to leave because Kostas wasn't even playing. So I'll give him a chance somewhere else. Brunson's back. Team's all set. I'll see you guys with the rotation 
at the start of the third and final season. So this is going to be the rotation for the third, whoops, third and final season. Dennis Smith Jr., Victor Oladipo, Luka Doncic, Miles Turner, and DeAndre Jordan. Off the bench, Zion Williamson, Robert Williams, Jalen Brunson, and Justin Holiday. We have Greg Monroe, probably won't play. Nine-man rotation, probably going to work. Let's go ahead, try to win another championship, and I'll see you guys at the end of season number three. So here at the end of the third and final season, Giannis does win MVP 65-17. and 17. Not too bad. Wiseman, Bonga, Kawhi. Bonga again, okay. Let's, he's up to an 81, not too bad. And Rick Carlisle does win coach of the year for us, so definitely earned him once again first in the West. No doubt, really. A 10 games up in the Lakers, who, Lonzo, they have Norman Powell starting. They still have Brandon Ingram off the bench. They have Steven Adams now, okay. Yeah, not a bad team, obviously, with LeBron. I mean, mm. player stats, Dennis Smith Jr. Listen, scoring, then it was Doncic, Oladipo, Turner, Williamson, Jordan. Rebounds was DeAndre Jordan, and assists was Dennis Smith Jr. So first round, Oklahoma City. Not as easy as last year, but come on. 2K. I tried to click circle to back out of it. I, just... Oh, this game makes no sense sometimes. It... Who wins a championship and then loses in the first round of the year after that? Just, just t It's just tough. 76 ers win the championship, and Ben Simmons is the finals MVP. God damn it, that's so annoying. But I wanted another championship, but unfortunately we couldn't get one. So hopefully you guys enjoyed. At least we got one championship done. That would have been pretty bad if we did not get one championship. So, again, I apologize for no video yesterday. I hope you can understand that I was kind of busy. So hopefully we're getting one out pretty much every day for the rest of the summer. Which really should happen. So if you guys have any other video ideas, let me know those down below in the comment section. I think I'm going to be doing a Paul George stays with OKC Thunder rebuild. Sorry I was pretty late on this one. I probably should have done this before, but all the LeBron stuff and, yeah, stuff like that. So if you guys enjoyed, leave a like down below. If you guys are new, make sure to subscribe, and I will see you guys all in the next video.